Hey, Donald X, what is the story behind Groundskeeper? This uh, is a, a short story. Uh, it started off as a two cost that said, while this is in play, when you buy a card, you may pay a coin for plus one victory point. That was the premise. It's like uh, this little goons version, but, you know, it gets to be cheap and a cantrip because I made you pay the coin. And that was not actually how it played. I think it turned out that it was insane. Yeah, it was insane. And so then the second version only worked on victory cards. And then it seemed like maybe this thing didn't want to actually cost two. And also, uh, it's nice not to have this payment of money on a card of it. it. You know, I wanted to get rid of buy. I didn't actually in Empires because of a uh, forum. But, uh, and, uh, you know, a couple cards ended up referring to buy. But I was, I was on the road towards getting rid of buy uh, when buy triggers. And uh, I prefer a when game trigger. And, uh, of course, when you gain it at some other time, you can't pay a coin anyway. So, uh, so the next version uh, triggers on gaining victory cards, and then it goes up to costing five, and that's Groundskeeper. And, uh, you know, I'm very happy with it. Uh, I think uh, Empires is very consistent overall. And, uh, you know, Groundskeeper gives you this, this thing to do. It's, it's this classic kind of card because it's useless at the beginning. But, you know, you, your strategy may involve wanting as many of them as you can get. I, you know, I like those. You know, I'm not, I'm not a fan of monolithic uh, strategies where your whole strategy is to buy a lot of cultists. You know, groundskeep, Groundskeeper is going to make you build a deck. So uh, I'm happy with it to this day. <laughs> hey, Bards, what do you have for us today? I am a copper strategist, don't care for normal draws. Avoiding thinnings, my real test and treasures are my cause. I scour kingdoms, cross the land as I search far and wide, each starting card to understand the power that's inside. Is it today I need to know? Is Counting House the buy? It's only good in combo decks, the foolish masses claim. They'll eat their words when they get wrecked by Counting House next game. A seller or a warehouse, surely there will be a way. Perhaps a beggar as a mouse, providing loads of pay. Is it today? I need to know. Is counting house the buy? But now with new prosperity, this key card's been unmade. A tragic victim of the anti-copper deck crusade. The strategies that once I did reduce to just a shell. To counting house I can but bid. Safe traveling fare thee well. Is it today? I need to know. Is counting house the buy? Thank you, Shara, for that uncommonly metrical tribute to Counting House. This song is a parody of the country classic Ghost Riders in the Sky, and perhaps another song as well. 